Hello there everybody and welcome back to another episode of Brotato. Today we're going to be playing the speedy character again. Why you ask? That's because I want to take the Joustin Lance out. So speedy gets plus 30% speed, plus 1 melee damage for every 2% speed you have, minus 100 armor when standing still, minus 3 armor. The Joustin Lance scales off of 30% of your speed and 50% of your melee damage, which is a very nice combo. It also gives you speed and it gives you minus 10% damage when standing still, which you're never going to stand still. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take this out and we're going to run around jousting people. Is that a thing? We could have done this with the knight character, but I thought this just screamed speedy to me. And it does scale better the more speed you get. So it's going to be nice. All right. In this particular case, I am going to go for some luck. I do want to try and get some... I don't actually need a Lumberjack shirt, I'll be honest with you. Uh, I do want to get some early luck. The main reason behind that is we want to get the power generator. That is going to be one of the key items that we need to make this run pretty much ridiculous scaling. The power generator, just in case you're not aware, it gives you percentage damage based on the amount of speed you have. I think it's a one for one, uh, if I'm not mistaken, which is a lot, actually. So that's what we're looking for today. Otherwise, we're just going to go for speed is, is pretty much the name of the game. We'll grab some harvest in there just so we've got some. Reroll here. I don't know why I rerolled again, because you can't really get... Uh, two of the same tiered weapons in the shop. There has to be a different tier. And to get a blue on tier 3 is unlikely. Not impossible, but unlikely. So, the, yeah, in terms of defense, I have no idea. I'll be honest with you, I never thought it that far. <laughs> I just finished work and I was like, right, this is, this is the character I'm going to play today. But we could go for... Uh, I was going to say we could go for some dodge, some health regen. That might be a nice little pickup for us. Going in for the attack speed and then going in for the cube monkey as well. Just to give us some form of healing. Because one of the biggest issues that we do have is when we get to high levels of speed, we are going to be running into enemies left, right and center. And if we... You can't always dodge, which is a slight concern. So we're going to want to be able to recover some of our health through different means. And I think Cute Monkey makes sense if we're dropping materials by killing enemies. We might be able to go for... Actually, you know what we could go for is dodge and then hope that we get Retromation's uh, hoodie. Then that's our attack speed sorted, which would be nice as well. We'll grab all of those, actually. Two jousting lances. You see here, this is the two different tiers. Just a nice little tip in case you didn't know that. But it's not something you really pay attention to, I don't think. But it was just something I noticed the other day. There we go. We got our crate. So yeah, in terms of speed, I think I'm aiming for about 150% speed up. That would be a nice little sweet spot because we'll get loads of percentage damage. If we do get power generator, that is a lot of percentage. So it'd be nice. We. Then yeah, let's go for a lot of health regen. I think that's where we want to be today. Go for the max health crit chance. Always like a bit of crit chance. So let's go into that to that. That was a pretty pretty good little uh, purchase there. So we want to get some max health because dodge isn't always consistent. So it, while we are running into enemies, we are bound to get hit. We want to just make sure that we have the ability to tank a couple just to be safe. Especially when we've got the elites and we're running around like a headless chicken at a 150% speed gets a diff bit difficult to control. So we're going to want to keep an eye out for that. There we go. 
so far so good. We are doing a good amount of damage. And that's only going to scale drastically as soon as we pick up some additional uh, items that we've got. I do want to get... I mean, I was going to say we do want to get some range up because we'll be tanking that, I'm pretty sure. Broken mouth, I'll take for the, the amount of max health it gives us. Peacock is nice as well. There's another Jousting Lance. I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to try and keep Peacock for Wave 9. Because obviously Peacock gives us 100% increased experience. Wave 9 is a Horde Wave. So that's where we're going to get a lot of experience. Uh, that's the benefits of it. Uh, and then it gives us plus 25 uh, experience after that. But at the same time, enemies for that next wave also uh, deal 50% more damage. Which I'm not too concerned about on a horde wave. It's just something that we need to keep in mind in the back of our heads. Because they do have the charges as well on that, that wave uh, towards the end. It's just something to bear in mind. They might do a little bit more than normal. Oh, 50% more than normal. Yeah. Damage-wise, I'm not worried. Not worried about the amount of damage we do. Uh, we will take that, though. This is all extremely tempting, and I am going to take it all. So, yes to this. I'll take all of these, actually. So we go Gentle Alien into Peacock for Wave 9. Cute Monkey... We get more of that, more coffee for the attack speed. That's a very good shop. A very, very good shop. I'm happy with that. We haven't had a lot of speed items at the moment, but the XP is going to help us get speed from level ups, which we get quite a good, sizable chunk from level ups. We, Because it goes up in threes, doesn't it? So you get 3, 6, 12%, and then legendary is 15%. Am I wrong? So yeah. I think we could easily get to uh, level 25. I think we would need a couple scars and that peacock, and then it would be guaranteed pretty much. Because we also have gentle alien that we want to pick up. So that's extra XP. Oops. <laughs> Speaking of scars. Right. Um. I'm. Um, okay. I wouldn't. I was going to go for the dodge, but luckily we got the speed and the dodge. So that's nice. So I said peacock, gentle alien. Oh, we can get all of it. And then a free reroll. Okay. Great. Alright, so we got to remember we take 50% increased damage this turn. But we started at the beginning of level 11. So watch our experience bar go up nice and quickly. There we go. That's level 12. Only thing I can think better than this is if we got a mouse instead of a uh, gentle alien. Or another scar. That would have been quite cool. There we go. So now we're kind of in the second half of wave 9. Which means we got more charges to deal with than the beginning. Hang on. Loot Goblet. Loot Goblet. Come here. There we go. And that's why we want Peacock on a Horde Wave. Because we pretty much got... We four level ups. Yes to Dangerous Bunny. Mm. I mean, no, we don't want that. Uh, let's go for percentage damage. Let's go for armor. Percentage damage. Okay, we're full blues now. Very nice. 
Again, I'm going to get our max health up as quickly as we can. Uh, what's all of this? So... What should we got? We can grab all of that. Why not? We'll try the life... We'll try the lifesteal angle. Don't really know how that's going to work. I really don't know how that's going to work with the Joustin Lance, but... Well, the answer is I don't think it is going to work. Definitely give it a go. We've got loads of enemies up. We got Scar and Peacock giving us loads of experience. Yeah, we'll be in a, a very good spot. Just got to get past wave 10. And remember, we do have two elite horde waves as well. So experience is going to be flowing today. But the downside with the elite horde waves is we got to remember that they can have those mummies which we should be able to one-shot, but if they get near us and do damage, oof, that is going to hurt. Okay. Trying to thread the needle there a little bit. But our dodge is not in a good spot at the moment. Oh, absolutely. We'll absolutely grab that. Combine this. Hmm, hunting trophy? That'll pay for itself, right? That should pay for itself. I don't want to go for speed down. Get a medal. I know we tanked our crit chance a little bit there. Uh, we'll take all those. Sure. All right. Wave 11, Horde Wave. Ow. I uh, didn't see that little enemy there because I've actually got my microphone in the way the one little spot that it's covering so this is what i meant by we've got to be careful because these mummies can hurt quite a bit so we're gonna have to thread the needle in a lot of these cases be plenty of damage just we don't want to walk into them is the ideal situation not until we have a good amount of attack speed or any form of knockback Rip and tear would be very valuable for us today. That would be very, very good because that's the uh, melee explosion. Repost would be good as well if we're going for the dodge angle. Actually, you know what? This is feeling a little bit better than I first anticipated. It was nice. Sure, we'll go for bait. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Uh, we'll go for the crit chance there. 12% speed is lovely. Combine. Uh, yes, we'll take that. More trees, more range. I think we can do that as well. Oh, that's unfortunate. One more reroll and then we'll call it a day. Schmoop. I'll take a schmoop. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, I think we got him. Free 8%. I do like that bait item. It's, it could either break your run or it could just be free 8%. <laughs> it just depends. But if you're feeling strong, you may as well take advantage of it. There we go. I'm happy with the amount of health we got. I could get it to 100. That'd be nice. Since this is now in the uh, normal branch and not the beta branch, the achievements for unlocking all four characters and then defeating the run with all four of the new characters uh, is available on Steam. I think one of the ones I haven't got yet is getting a maximum of 100 health. So maybe we can do that today. That's so much range. I've got to take that because there are things that are going to tank our range. So I don't want to do speed down anymore. Thank you. Sure. 
That's never gonna happen. Okay. We're starting to get weapons. We're full... E full epics. Great. Another scar. We are going towards... Ooh, level 25. Level 25 will be nice. Now, I'm just asking for a power generator. That's all I'd like. One thing I never checked is when the next horde wave was. It wouldn't be wave 13, right? It would probably be like 15. Yeah, this doesn't feel like a horde wave, so that's okay. Remember, don't stand still or you are toast. So you gotta dodge, duck, dive, weave all over the place where you can. There we go. As we go straight in here. Through the middle. Up, 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 up. Around the corner. Then straight through the middle. Loot Goblin. See you later, Loot Goblin. Very nice. Yeah, I'll take that. Uh, I'll take that. That's what I meant by we're going to be tanking quite a bit. Yes, I'll take the dodge. Yep, I'll take that for the crit chance. Secret sausage, nope. Damage and lifesteal. There's the tardigrade, which might be nice. Alright. So now we have our horde wave. Again. Oh, it's these guys. Oh, no. But this could spell disaster for us if we don't make sure we get rid of the little babies. They're going to be problematic. See what I mean? Similar to the last time we fought them. They're just more annoying than not. We're going to just come clean around the edge here. Go through the middle. We're trying to take out as many things as we can. Just to give us a bit more room to work with. There's a tree there. Get that consumable up. Wow. I was kind of hoping we'd see a few more consumables... Oh, there we go, from our luck. I should take... I should have taken the baby elephants and things like that, but... Just didn't fancy it today. Uh, yep, I'll take that. So, cute monkey we definitely want to go for. I'll take a snail. Just slows them down. Like a blood leech again. I'm not going to take a glass cannon today don't think that's worth it because we already do a decent chunk of damage it's not the most amazing thing in the world because our speed is not quite where i wanted it today but that's okay all right we got to deal with these little babies again i would rather deal with the eggs than deal with the little babies if i'm being honest because we could kill the big egg things. Trying to get these babies can put us in a dangerous spot. And they have ranged abilities, which is the big issue. It's the big issue. Now, if we're asking for items, could I have an adrenaline or a repost? That'd be nice. That'd be very nice. Or a community support. Sure. More percentage damage. Let's try and get something a little bit better. Here we go. More experience. Sure. More enemies. Sure. Why not? A little bit of cake. Why Etsy's couch? This is the worst run you could possibly do for me. 
any other run and I would 100% take you. That is... a lot. Okay, how much XP gain have we got? 125% XP gain. Oh, wow. All right. Let's just clear out everyone. Pop up. This is no problems whatsoever. Get wrecked. That's what I'm saying. We definitely need Retromation's hoodie. That'll help us out a little bit. Because community support is all right. But if you're doing really well, no, it's it's definitely going to help us in this run because we've got such such a large number of enemies. We've buffed them up quite a bit. So I think we'll be okay. Just going to help us out a little bit. Wow. There we go. We've got to be careful because some of these charges have been buffed up. Which we don't really want to deal with them. There we go. That was nice. That was smooth. Uh, yeah. Ooh. I can't remember if it's the elite wave. We're taking it. I might regret that. 100% might regret that. Alright, we need four more health. It's not the elite wave. Okay, good. Uh, more melee damage. Yep. Speed up. Yep. I'll take a plant. Hello. Extra stomach. Plus one max health when picking up a consumable while at maximum health. Yeah. We'll, we'll take that. All right. So we're about halfway on level 24. Okay. These buffy boys are needing to go very quickly. Oh no! This baby's on this wave. That's not going to be good. That's not going to be good at all. Especially if they're doing 50% more damage. Is that extra stomach? Do you think that's too late? That's not too late, is it? I mean, it could potentially get us... Uh, maybe it's not worth running today. No, I'm going to run it anyway, regardless. We're definitely going to get the consumables. So, I'm not worried about that. Especially because all of the consumables come towards us at the end of the wave, so we'll at least get something. Rip and tear is lovely today. Nope. We did get to this. Okay. Here we go. Where's the speed? Speed. One more. Speed. One more. Really? Alright, we're going for dodge. <laughs> Extra stomach. We'll take that. I mean a garden as well. Sure. Ah, I'll take that. Okay. I'm just trying to think about what we want to do in terms of recovery. Okay, I want to bring him out a little bit. I mean, I brought him out, but now I need to actually go deal with him. Okay, there we go. Okay. There we go. We've got to be a bit careful. So obviously there's all of these projectiles that are going on at the moment. This is the main concern I've got on the final boss as well. Is the fact that there's just so many projectiles. It's going to be a bit tricky. There we go. Max health. Great. There we go. Scroll all the way down here. It's zoom. Whoa. Nearly done, nearly done. Whoa. Okay. 
think I'm going to say no to whetstone. Mm. 15 melee damage. That is a lot. Minus 3% speed, minus 8% damage. I can't do the maths. I can't do the maths. One, one damage for every two speeds you have. Okay, so... Yeah, that's probably worthwhile. Yeah, we'll take the mammoth. Very nice. Uh, extra percentage damage. Is anyone going to give me a... Power generator? No. Mm, power generator? No. All right. I will admit, starting on half health feels sketchy as hell. I'm not going to lie. But there's quite a few items we never got today that we really wanted to. I mean, rip and tear. Eh. Would have liked it a bit earlier, I think. But we're doing okay. We're doing a good job. Community support has definitely helped considering we tanked up the number of enemies we got. Look at that. We're, we could potentially hit level 30. I don't know if we're going to hit that on this wave. No, we won't hit that on this wave, I doubt. That's still quite cool, though. Can we hit 29 at least? 29, please. Yeah, there we go. I think it's going to be a normal level up. No, I'm not taking it out of the way. 9% dodge. There we go. We capped our dodge. Attack speed. Okay, so last wave. 176 damage. I'm going to recycle that for those. Sure. Oh. Power generator. No. Power generator. Mm, no. But we'll take that and that. Uh, power generator. Dang. I'll take a bit more range. Okay. This is not exactly how I wanted this one to go. I think with power generator, we would, would have been at like nearly 200% damage. We're doing okay. A little bit of crit. All right, let's go. All right, there's a nullify gone, unfortunately. All right. Trying to keep them close together so that we can at least damage them both at the same time. You see what I mean? It gets to a point where it's quite sketchy. outspeed most of these things which is nice get that consumable sorry i'm having to focus a little bit on this one we got buffy boys in as well which is a bit of a concern to say the least okay Let's see if we can get this guy out Oh. Remember, it's a full heal if we can get him. Oh, there we go. Full heal. Now we go for this guy. Oh, we got him. There we go. Well done. Well done, everyone. Oh, and that's Speedy with the Jousting Lance. A bit sketchy because I think it gets a, a little bit crazy to handle but I mean look at the amount of XP gain we got 150 <laughs> so, um, that's a lot actually but yeah if we managed to get adrenaline or a power generator I think this would have been a completely different game 
That was pretty interesting. Gave us quite a bit of help, which is very nice. But yeah, there we go, guys. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see any particular type of build on the new guys, old guys, whichever, uh, definitely let me know in the comment section down below. Even modded, uh, we can have a look at that. But there we go. Like and subscribe if you did enjoy it, and I will catch you all in the next one. Bye for now.